Hey, are you the Windows XP embedded president? President? Yes. <laughs> okay, and so what's cool about Windows XP embedded? Oh, everything is cool. We can do lots of cool stuff. Um, we just launched our feature pack in November. So Steve. what does that give you? So what that gives you is a couple of new features that are really cool. USB boot, which allows you to boot from a USB fob. It allows us to take down the cost of our hardware. Bomb cost goes way down. Okay. Uh, brought us into new categories of uh, devices. We also made available a file-based write filter, which is an embedded enabling feature. That's really cool for media center type devices. Because now you have the ability to write protect the operating system, but leave, let's say, your movie content exposed. Okay. And, and for users, that saves the operating system. It doesn't get corrupted. But you also, but you want to be able to change your photos. You want to be able to update your music. So it allows that type of class of device. Now, when I hear the term Windows XP embedded, I yeah. think, didn't Microsoft just release Windows Vista? Are you bringing any of the technologies in Vista to XP embedded? Yeah, we are. Um, we're basically right now uh, looking at how we can do that. So we have, we've got a, the feedback from the OEMs. They've ranked the top features they want. And the features that we're bringing are IE7. Okay. Uh, Windows Media Player 11, okay. the .NET framework, which gives you Windows presentation, Windows communication framework, Avalon Indigo code names, and finally RDP 6.0. So cool. the key, the key technologies connect to the server backend from Longhorn launches, plus the visual key visual ones from uh, Vista as well. Very cool. Well, yep. thanks, John. No Appreciate problem. it. Thanks. Take care.